The marked as final feature is basically a flag to the end user that this is the final draft, and as a part of that flag, it will disable all editing tools on the ribbon and set the document read-only mode so they can't make any changes to it and save the document. Now to turn this feature on, say OK, this is it, we're done, this is the final document. Come up here, click on the File tab, Info selected by default, click on Protect Document, and there you go. Let's the readers know that the document is final and make it read-only. Click on it. This document will be marked as final and then saved. OK. And then it says the document has been marked as final to indicate that editing is complete and this is the final version of the document. When a document is marked as final, the status property is set to final and typing, editing, commands, and proofing marks are turned off. You can recognize that a document is marked as final when the mark as final icon displays in the status bar. Didn't I sound like a TV announcer? Oh, I'm just giddy. Let's go ahead and click okie dokie. And you can see this document has been marked as final to discourage editing, or if you're in the front stage view, there you go, marked as final. And as it promised, down below on the status bar, you got the stamp there. Well, I don't know if you can see the icon, but it's a little stamp that made its mark that says final. And you can hover over it, it says marked as final. And so you send it off to somebody, and then when they get it, they can go, oh, this is final. Of course, there's no security behind it because you can go ahead and click on it, edit anyways, but as it says, it's to discourage. You can come up here and click on the Home tab and try to use any commands here, but you can't. You can see it says the command is currently disabled until you go ahead and turn off the mark as final and allow changes to the document. Oh, okay. Edit, and now you can go ahead and make changes to it.